so in today's video um, I'm gonna try the I will say I want to try Python but I'm gonna leave it for the last one Python is extremely popular especially for network admins if you are if you're going for CCNA uh, I strongly strongly urge you to consider learning Python as well especially with the since the CCNA they have like a like coding or programming certificate as well now uh, that will start now in three months in September uh, February of 2020 so you sh really should uh, consider it so let's uh, done with uh, start with the Microsoft Word and um, <coughs> this machine is uh, powering on um, looks like it's going to be just Windows 10 let's do that close it out while waiting for the machine to power on it's saying okay let's go so <clears throat> create a document this will be extremely easy so I was hoping that it's office 365 but it looks like it's office 2016 so creating a docu document is very easy once you open uh, your Microsoft Word you get to this page <clears throat> here it's a blank one and then it's like a a few templates as there uh, there as well that you can choose and then added them uh, to your needs you see there are quite a few uh, there's a full calendar up there was a half calendar this one certificate as well so basically this is what you cl click either one of them and uh, start working so let's say let's see what they want us to do we already did that open by default <clears throat> so here they missed it so uh, that it's not uh, open by default we since by the look of it it's the black one we go with the black one open by default and then if you want if you're working here and then you want to add another one for example you write a s d e or f and then you want a new one you can simply click here and get the blank click on the black one and you see now you have two if you hover over here uh, you see the first one is document one and then you have a document two so you can toggle between them from here if I click here and you see document one right there the name is right here and if I click document two it's like that so let's close out the document too click black document okay black document so the second task is that using templates to create a black document it's the same they just keep insisting uh, because this change I think it's a little bit outdated on the left so that's we have the templates here and all we have to do is just click one of them so this one is a little bit different they want you to search it so file <coughs> new search for online templates uh, so basically these are all the categories that you can click in for example if you holidays are around the corner if you click holiday and you see we have Thanksgiving and all the that we can work with the templates <coughs> so they want you to click on the business let's go to home and then click on business so if you see 
this is the business one that uh, we have all the templates in here but then we have categories subcategories on the right side over here and if I go all the way I can keep scrolling and I hope there's pages and yeah all right so it's like uh, and in, in I think we are looking at 129 templates in one page and we can sort them through these subcategories select the sales invoice template it should be sales let's click here sales rather than the go from up there <coughs> and we have sales invoice blue grad and sales invoice green grad got green yep so we can click either one of them it looks like a bit uh, this more like a, a bill type and this like more like a graphic designer uh, stuff so let's go with the bell type that looks like a bell click create and it will be created and we are here so we can do the editing in there <coughs> oh so yeah this is the one uh, you can edit PDF through this you don't need Ac Adobe Acrobat for that <coughs> so not all pdf documents can be edited in word all right all right so they want you to go to a certain um, location so now we click they want you to open it and then go to see user so click on this pc see users administrator that is going to be hard we cannot go any up reason oh through the browse <coughs> so we click on this PC here so we get all the get to see all the drives then we're gonna go to C next they want you to go to users and then admin and then documents then word 2016 word 2016 level 2 student data and manage documents now we are in there if I can show you nope nope so if i can do it like bigger so you see this is the path exactly the path that uh, they wanted us to go <clears throat> if i click here you see this is the path becomes so it changes now they want you to open launch menu double click on it and it open and you say if you can see Java Tucana launch menu okay click on file and select save as so this time we're gonna save and I'm guessing that we're gonna save as as a PDF <coughs> they want you to click a dot place and uh, save it as a uh, location I'm gonna save in the same folder save the type to PDF so over here this is the type you can click on um, any of these types and it will convert the file into that uh, format for you <coughs> keep using this app we can click okay let's click on Adobe reader and you see if I you see it's launch menu uh, Adobe Reader uh, that's the Adobe sign and all that all right they want you to close the Microsoft Word then there is an easier way close all window if you right click here we're gonna close all window so we're done with Word over there it's blinking for us giving us don't save no don't save all right 
Now what they want you to do? Load the Okay, so let's and there's a lunch menu PDF on your desktop. No, there is not. I never saved it on the desktop. For the purpose of this exercise, the document will be saved to the desktop. It never it never was because I never saved it over there. So what I did is I saved it in documents. Word level two managing documents and you see right there because I customized it they wanted you to do that they never instructed they but they assumed that it will be saved there no it, it was not so now they want you to open it in word the best way is always open with the reason is that first you go to the file that you see oh yeah this is the one and then all you have to do is right click rather than you launch a program like word and through go to the file open menu and then remember that we had to uh, go through clicking all the way to come to this one uh, the doc word document one <coughs> all right but uh, the reason I want to go I want to do that because of this numbers two option this is very important a lot of people like they cannot see the file because of this one if the file extension is not associated so that's why I'm going and showing you so this time it's still up and uh, it's you see and you say hey there's no file over here that's a good thing we launched it and it's asking us to create a blank document but uh, we wanted to open that PDF document in that we you can use this one open another document and now we have the file menu we click on open and then browse for 2016 level 2 managing documents and lunch menu it's asking convert your PDF to in so basically when it's saved into PDF it's converted the word document into PDF and saved it now to open and edit it it's giving us the message that uh, uh, I'm gonna convert it back to a PDF uh, back to a word document and so you can edit it I'm gonna say okay so the other way was that that you would click right click on it it says the first option if I double click it it's gonna open in Adobe if I click open it's gonna still do the same but there's this neat option it gives me an option <coughs> where to open it open it with Adobe or my browser or the word if I click word you see it open up in the word document <coughs> all right and the close they want you to always use this one it gives you a prompt if you made any change if you had made any changes it gives you a prompt to save it again we are with the open <coughs> again browse and we, this time we're going to word level 2 manage documents same place we are here coffee house is documented all right position your cursor under part 1 heading this is the one under okay So since it's asked me to uh, under it so uh, I press enter one time and now it's under on insert tab under the text menu click on arrow to the right of the object button so they want you to go to the insert menu and arrow to the right on the right of the object button I 
I don't see any object. Under the text menu, file, nope, back, home. Styles, paragraph, phone, clipboard, editing. So where is the text? <coughs> Right there. This was the one. Objects right there. <coughs> Text from file. <coughs> right there all right so now again and you see everything that was in the PDF file is now under part one so it was uh, all the data has been added into the file uh, into this file from another file from an external one <clears throat> file close okay let's do it do we want to save it no yeah definitely so this is all good and that was the word thing i liked it actually i learned something new i i was have been using when office since I think it was back in Office 97 or 98, something like that. And with Office 2000, I think. Or it was Office 2000. Yeah, I've been using since ever since. Because I remember the Office 2003 was a big deal. Yep, so it was Office 2000. <coughs> when I first uh, started. <coughs> so, I... this was fun so this was it Microsoft uh, Word 2016 pretty small one but it was fun I liked it if you have learned anything new in through this video please like share comment and subscribe and you have a good night <coughs>